Being a small independent product maker is a legit new career choice. Being a small independent product maker is a legit new career choice. Yeah, so I think in the old days, and by old days, I mean eh, 10, 12 years ago before the internet was really as pervasive as yeah. it is now, yeah. there were people who worked in careers, there were freelancers, and there were entrepreneurs using a, a capital E, if you will. Yeah. We talked at the outset about this. Like, what do we call ourselves? Well, entrepreneur a lot of times has all this baggage and it feels yeah. like this, I'm an entrepreneur, I wear a suit to work and I talk to venture capitalists. And I go to the bank and I say, can I get a loan? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> well, now we're seeing, and this is, uh, this is something that we see in a lot of friends of ours, frankly, Yeah. that just being an independent product maker, not even necessarily an entrepreneur, but maybe an entrepreneur with a small e. Yeah. This is a basically a new career. Yeah. It's as it's just like I, you know, work for financial services. Now instead, I work as an independent product builder and I go out there and I find people who have problems and I solve those problems and I put up a little solution for them mm -hmm. on the internet. This them. makes me think of of one guy in particular of a couple people, Justin Jackson. Yeah. Totally. Like Justin Jackson's a great idea where, where, where he had a podcast right there. It was like every week he was launching a new thing, right? Yeah. Every week he would try a new product. Yeah. He would like make something new from scratch every single week and he would write do a podcast about it. And this is a, this is a fun thing to be, you know, it's. It makes me think of, of, of being a hunter where it's like, Hey, actually I can keep my family fed. Yeah, not you know just I mean? keep them fed, but probably, you know, earn more than you would in a career, yeah, a regular yeah. career. Way more autonomy. And it may feel less stable at times because you have to scramble. Yeah. But, you know, over the long term, there's this, you know, continuity that happens. And uh, this is made possible, again, because of the Internet. Yeah. You can now create digital products. You can sell them to people that you reached yourself because of social media. And this just wasn't possible 15 years ago or, or 20 years ago yeah. and before that. Fizzleshow.co slash 193. That's where you're going to find the article that Corbett's written about this podcast episode.